it's boost up session here and today i'll be teaching you how to mount hardware encrypted wd hard disk it could be any wd elements my passport ultra my passport any hard disk wd which is hardware encrypted and it should be external all right in linux any distribution fedora kali ubuntu kubuntu l ubuntu and a lot of are there in the market all right with read and write support both read and write okay so first of all what you need to do is just copy this cookpw.py file and it's right there i will give you the zip file for that copy this to the desktop just copy and paste it now you have this file now after copying this file to the desktop just launch terminal by typing control alt and t press them at the same time and in here just type uname minus m machine it will show you the version of your machine that is you're running a 64 bit operating system otherwise if it would have been 32 bit it will show you this i386 okay this will be shown right here now after this you need to install all these files right here all of these according to your system architecture let me show you if you are using 64 bit then install this this one and that's it only two files these are rpm files which are supported by fedora and any other distributions you need to check about that on the internet that which kind of files your system supports all right now as my operating system is 64 bit so and the operating system is ubuntu which support dot deb files okay first of all you need to install this libs gutls file okay after that you can install that file make sure you are connected to the internet and now it has been installed now you can install this second file just click on install now both these files has been installed now what you need to do is just run these commands into the terminal of u12 first of all type in sud or space su and type your user password press enter and now just drag and drop this line or just copy and paste it it's already the newest version if it's not then you need to type y and press enter after what it asks for now it is also automatically installed just type all the commands one by one into the terminal make sure you're connected to the internet now after doing this just copy and paste the last command also and just type y to update all the packages now until it gets update what we need to do is just plug in your my passport or any wd hard disk which is hardware encrypted and here you see that we have a wd unlocker option and if you open this we have an exe file which is only supported by windows so what we're gonna be doing is just close it from here and in here just copy this command up to here only and paste it into the terminal and press enter now here it will show you the wd hard disk it is right there it is sdc attached scsi disk if you doesn't see it right here you can recognize it by now here you can see my passport okay and this is a lot of times it's only sdc scsi disk let me confirm it also just go to the disk and here right is right there 2tb hard disk i have a 2tb hard disk and it's de definitely shown in here here you can see it is sdc so remember this sdc all right because we're gonna be using this so now just run this command press enter here what you have to do is 
as you have previously copied this file cookpw.py to the desktop now in here without quotes you need to put your password okay so just put in your password in here and after putting the password if the password is wrong the hard disk will not be mounted okay so just copy this command paste it into the terminal and press enter now let me go to the desktop first here you can see we have a file password.bin bin okay now after that file has been shared to the desktop just copy this below command and in here you have to put the location of your hard disk that is sdc that we have just seen in the disk okay so just copy it from here and just paste it into the terminal let me clear that just drag and drop it or just copy and paste it everything works fine and press enter now here you can see that scsi status is good as the password was right so the hard disk must have been mounted and here you can see it is wd my passport hard disk let me show you new folder you can create a folder you can delete it whatever you want okay so this way you can mount wd hard disk which is hardware encrypted one into the linux with read and write support and wait a minute please subscribe and like boost up session for more and more tricks thank you for watching now it's time to discover more simply click on the screen to subscribe to our channel and watch another video to discover more